All scorpions give birth to live young. In fact, they're the only arachnids that give birth to live young. Once she gives birth, she, she forms what's called a birth basket, which is where she kind of arches her back up and, and makes a basket with her arms so that as the babies come out, they, she catches them and they crawl up her arms under her back and they stay up there for, for until when they molt. Uh, they have to shed their entire skeleton and then regrow or reharden another skeleton on the outside of their body. And when they first come out, you know, they kind of look almost like larvae or something. They're white, they're kind of chubby, they don't look like they can defend themselves at all. And once they've shed their, their first exoskeleton, then they, they just look like little tiny miniature scorpions. And at that point, they start leaving the mother slowly, not all at once, but when they're ready. Uh, and then they'll, they'll go off and, and they're able to eat and hunt their own prey. Molting, also known as ectasis, is a fascinating natural phenomenon observed in various animal species. From insects to reptiles and even some mammals, these creatures undergo a remarkable process of shedding their old exoskeletons or outer layers to make way for new growth. Molting plays a vital role in their growth, development, and adaptation to changing environments. Watch this. Watch this. Y'all see the babies? They came off her back. They came off her back. They came off her back. They're so cute. They're so cute. I got a freaking bunch of babies. Bunch of babies. Look at all them. Look at all them. Look at all these cuties. Look at that. Look at that cute scorpion right there. I don't want mama to pinch me, but I really want to grab this yamin. Oh, my bad, bro. The baby scorpions are literally everywhere. So right now, I'm going to have to take all the baby scorpions out the enclosure and stick them into this enclosure right here. The reason I got to do this is because this mama scorpion will start cannibalizing on her children randomly if she gets a little bit too hungry. Yeah, that's not nice, dude. But real quick, before I play the ultimate game of hide and go seek against 50 goddamn scorpion babies, let me see if I can feed my baby mama. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, she was hungry, hungry. She was hungry, hungry. Shay. Nice and good munchins. Nice and good munch.
do scorpions eat their mother after birth? And the answer is no, scorpions do not typically eat their mothers.